Houston, we're copying. F2, I'm at one one sixtieth second. Yeah, we can see you coming down the ladder now. Roger, we copy. Yeah, pretty good little job. And now step off the land now. That's one small step for man. One giant leap for man. Wow, you were in a tough spot. I am so sorry, but thank you so much. Well, it's a hard spot. It's our most dangerous, hard volunteer spot we got. You need a beer? Can I leave you one here, just in case you change your mind? You like light ones, dark ones, IPAs? Seven o'clock, first wave, 710, Joe's, 720, bros, and 730, my favorite class, who knows? Just out there to enjoy some single track. Conan, we got all of our friends here, old friends, new friends, where you been, friends? I'm Perry Jewett. I started the Dakota 5.0 17 years ago. I'm the race director, uh, creator of it came up with the course. I went out there and started kicking sticks out of the way and kind of linking up a trail, uh, cow trails, deer trails, um, no trail in between. It just kind of started snowballing from there. As the week ramps up closer to the 5.0, we definitely get hectic busy and um, it's so much fun to have 700 riders in town. I consider them all my friends. We close off part of Main Street, have a band playing down there. Several of, uh, of the vendors are there selling some of their items and it's just a nice opportunity for riders to have a meet and greet and just get a feel for the town. Part of the lure of the 5-0 is when people come to Spearfish, they can camp at the city park campground and uh, park their car for the whole weekend, ride to the festivities, ride to the start. All right, Smokey, when Smokey drops his hand, pedals ready, bikers ready. came up with the motto is a blessing or a curse, we're gonna run it in reverse. So we gave it a shot and uh, it was very well received. So now we alternate the course. My uh, sound people have a hot mic for me. My favorite part of the day is the <laughs> pedal power. Cold hard cash on the line, $7,000 in cash to be given away. $20,000 in prizes, it pays to ride at the Dakota 5-0. You know, so that's the, that's usually how it starts out in the morning or from there, it just keeps on getting busier. Kelly, you're back, I love it. Yeah, Broom, looking sharp. Yeah! <laughs> We've had the race capped at 700 for um, about five years now. We don't really intend to let it grow. We kind of like the size, it's manageable. We don't want to spoil a good thing. That's the right left, Stadium Ridge. Clean it like you mean it, Alan. Get it! All the way, buddy! Nice job! The Angel Station. Um, the girls keep coming back every year and uh, they have a good time down there. They have a, a keg of beer for the hardy folks that might want a little swig to replenish and sometimes they'll even give you a birthday shot. Yeah, Warrior! The Yeah, buddy. Yeah, it, uh, yeah, it just feels a little sticky. Yeah, yeah boy! Hard right, hard right, hard right, right here, hard right, go get it. Mid course, about mile 22, is uh, old Baldy, and where he's got a band playing and lots of cowbell. For old Baldy, thanks to the Zamboni brothers for live music, mile 26.
from there they progress up to the bacon station. From, that's where we have 60 pounds of um, perfectly cooked bacon, thanks to uh, Christian and his uh, wife Rachel throwing down the bacon station. Their whole family makes it a, a, we even have what we've patented as the bacon danglers, where they take string with uh, clothespins and bacon clipped to it. So throughout the woods, there's bacon strips randomly hanging off of uh, clothespins and riders have a good time. Mountain bikers are good people in general, but the people that show up for the 5 are here to have a good time and ride their guts out for themselves. It's like a personal thing. They're not always racing against each other, but they're trying to improve their time because uh, it seems that when they come here, they end up coming back to do it again. I think a lot of the riders come back down to the park not sure and how you know if they're going to do it again and after one croak feet beer they're already planning for the next year so um, that's part of the lure and it's part of the that's like, that's where the healing begins is at the crow peak lineup and all right congratulations to all the riders pedal power 17th annual dakota five -0. The Dakota 5.0 is a 50-mile uh, mountain bike race, race ride tour that uh, starts and ends in Spearfish, South Dakota. We've uh, been putting it on 17 years, and it's on challenging, varied single track. There's a variety of uh, trails out there that'll challenge the best riders.